New today, Governor Laura Kelly is releasing the total allocation amounts for each hospital taking part in the Frontline Hospital Workers Retention Plan. It's an effort to help hospitals keep and attract new members to their staff. In a statement, Governor Kelly says this $50 million will help us retain and attract more frontline hospital workers as we continue to fight this virus. For over 18 months, our health care workers have risked their lives every day to protect Kansas from COVID-19. It's our responsibility to make sure they have the support they need to continue. And here's how the money breaks down for some of our local hospital systems. It was distributed based on multiple factors, including total number of hospital beds with more than 1300 beds on three campuses across Kansas. The University of Kansas Health System will receive $7.3 million. About five and a half million of that supports the immediate metro. Other hospitals getting more than a million dollars include Advent Shawnee Mission, Providence Medical Center, Overland Park Regional and Olathe Health.